I've got a 2015 Nissan Rogue Select. Went to go do emissions and it failed. The, the failure wasn't super helpful. It just said uh, something about the vehicle not being ready. So I came home. As you can see, I'm plugged into the OBD port. And sure enough, my reader's not working, meaning that port is not getting any power. So I started researching. Some Nissans have a uh, fuse panel. Let's see if I can get this stupid camera to focus. Doesn't like me. Some rogues will have a fuse panel right behind here. It's off to the side of the driver's seat. I pop that off and I do not have a fuse panel there. It's just a, a blank slate. So I don't know what's, I don't know what models or what differences would have that. But again, this 2015 select does not. Where I do have a fuse panel though is right here. And when I popped off this cover, I realized that this fuse right here, or fuse holder, this is not even pushed in all the way. This is just kind of dangling here. I don't know why it's dangling there, but as soon as I pushed it in, I can now look down and I'm getting power to the OBD2 port. So for whatever reason, that black fuse holder, again, this guy right here, that's holding the fuse or covers the fuse that runs the OBD port. And so now I have power there and I'm actually going to double check and see if my IM status is good to go. Because if it is, I should be able to pass emissions. So let me grab my keys here. That's it. I'm putting my keys in. I'm going to check the IM status. And look at that. Everything's good. So I should pass emissions just fine. They just couldn't actually read that due to that fuse. So all should be well. Hopefully this helps somebody, and if you have questions, feel free to ask. Have a good one.